Hey guys, it's me, Dee Dee, and I've got something with me here. Oreos! I don't know what the buzz is about uh, with the Oreos right now, but it's, it's really, really frustrating me. And, um, I just, I don't, I don't get it. I really don't get it. Why do people have such a big deal with the Oreo company and just their their thoughts and their feelings and just why would you boycott eating oreos they're so good first off and and second off it's it's not gonna hurt you or anything you know holy shit, i turned gay Okay, so here's the deal. Um, hold on a second. I have another computer right over here, just so you know. Yeah, so in support of Pride, which was this past, is it this past weekend? Yeah, this past weekend. Um, Oreo company came out with a campaign poster here that was it had the Oreo and then it had like the inside and it was all the different colors in the rainbow and so it says June 25th and then it says pride well um, it says made with cream colors that do not exist well the Oreo company use that to show its support for gay pride and so um there's a few comments and stuff uh and and basically there are a lot of people who posted just really really terrible comments like um i'm not going to have oreos again if you want to lose a lot of your consumers just because of some gay people in your company thought it was a fantastic campaign then go ahead. And and six people liked that. And it says, I'll stick to my black and white Oreos. F gay Oreos. And it says, what a shame. Guess I'll have to choose another cookie. I no longer eat Oreos. I wish they had a dislike button. You gay people make me sick. God made us to be man and woman, not gay or lesbian. P.S. No more Oreos. I'm unliking Oreos because of this. No matter Oreos, no more Oreos for me or my family. Gay can, gays can go kill themselves, and they are sinners and will burn in hell. So, uh, apparently there's a huge stink going around that um, gay people in the Oreo company thought that it would be a good idea to have a campaign for Pride Month. And so, in support of Pride, they uh, had this campaign poster, and it's just causing a huge, huge stink. Well, I also, on Tumblr, where I get most of my news, had stumbled upon um, this post that said uh, it is in response to all the people who are boycotting, uh, hold on a second, all the people who are boycotting Oreos, and so the, it says a list of companies that you wouldn't even think supporting gay rights. Um, it says, Dear people boycotting Oreos for supporting gay rights. The following companies also support gay rights. Allstate, Amazon, American Airlines, Apple, Apple Bees, Best Buy, Clorox, Coca-Cola, which means they manufacture Coke, Diet Coke, Dr. Pepper, Fanta, Vitamin Water, and Dasani, uh, Costco, Delta Airlines, Ford, Gap, which also owns Banana Republic, and Old Navy, um, General Motors, Gerber Baby Products, Hilton Hotels, Home Depot, IMB, uh, Levi's, Marriott International, McDonald's, 
Microsoft Nationwide, Nike Olive Garden, PepsiCo, which manufactures Pepsi, Diet Pepsi, Mountain Dew, Sierra Mist, Sobe, Life Water, Lipton Tea, Amp Energy Drinks, and Aquafina. Procter & Gamble, which manufactures literally almost all home and bath products that you buy at the grocery store. Red Lobster, Rite Aid, Sears, Southwest Airlines, Starbucks, State Farms, Target, United Airlines, UPS, Walgreens, and the Walt Disney Company. Now, look at that list and tell me that people are going to be mad. But are they going to be mad enough to boycott everything? And so when the Oreo company, I know people say, we can live without cookies, it's making a statement. I don't care. These right here, there's some pretty amazing cookies. Like, uh, where did you get the idea to boycott the Oreo company? What is this? Like, what is this? I'm gay. I love Oreos. I didn't even know they supported the gay community. See, society is based upon what people like and what people don't like. And so when you have homophobic people out there, they're going to look at their favorite companies. They're going to watch closely to see, oh, do, do they support gay rights? Do they support that? But you can't go and say you're going to boycott Oreos because they support gay rights. But then you're going to look at this list and say, holy crap, I can't support them because they support gay rights, but I need to fly on an airplane. I, I love Coca-Cola. You know, I love Pepsi. That's all the sodas that is like listed. I mean, even the spin-off version, you could say that I'm gonna buy a spin-off version of everything. I'm no longer gonna go to McDonald's. You know, just say that, you know? Go ahead, look at this list and, and try to live without these things. I, Oreos is, is why? Why would you boycott Oreos? And most of the people who are like, I hate the Oreo company now because they support gay rights, they don't realize that this other list exists. And there are so many other companies who support gay rights out there, more than this list. But these are the big ones and it's very important to know that there's so many people out there who support gay rights. And the fact that these other people are going to go out and say, I'm not eating Oreos anymore just because it, they support gay rights. They're ignorant. And ignorance is it was one of the biggest ec epidemics in our country, I believe, right now. And it's really, <laughs> it's really, really bad because it's creating, like, so many problems for people out there. And I feel as though gay rights is an issue right now and it should be something that is debated. It should be something that's in every single household and it should be something that should be accepted. Gay rights is a part of so many people's lives and you see it every day and you go to school with gay people, you go to work with gay people, you go to work with people who are in the LGBTQ community that you may not even think are affected by the LGBTQ community. But in reality, almost everybody is. There's gay relatives, there's gay co-workers, there's gay students that attend school with you. Honestly, it's like going back to civil rights era with the civil rights movement with the black and white issues, with the, the immigrants. Like, it's the same thing. And I don't understand why people have to be so ignorant. And so, for now, I'm just going to do whatever I can to get the word out about um, just the rest of the companies that support gay rights and see what people have to say because in all honesty, this is probably one of the most ignorant things I've ever seen involving the LGBTQ community and homophobia. And so I do ask that you spread this video around. You, you spread this link to whoever you wish to send it to. and. I hope that people can just understand a little bit more. I feel like a lot of people are afraid and that's why they are homophobic because they're afraid of something that they don't understand. But all going back 
full circle. Oreos, Oreo company, props to you. Congratulations. I'm so happy for you. Don't listen to what anybody says. And, you know, the people that love your Oreos, the true fans that you have eating your Oreos, they'll get over it. They'll keep buying the Oreos. They'll keep, keep eating them. They'll keep being able to have them throughout their house and at parties. Don't, you know, it, I don't think this is going to be a big deal. But, uh, I just feel as though I needed to talk a little bit about this. And so I hope you enjoyed my video. And if you feel as though you want to know more or you want me to talk about more gay rights things or um, just anything you have questions about, uh, comment below or send me a message up in uh, on my profile. There's a link you can send me a message. Uh, subscribe and uh, also follow me on Tumblr, follow me on Twitter, I'll put those links below and I will be talking to you all very soon. Thank you for watching my video and have a great day. Bye.